And now, Fox 34 Your Health with Nicole Garza. Thanks to the home health industry, the chronically ill or those who can't get around on their own can get the services they need without leaving their house. Here's how one local business is improving their ability to monitor patients, even when a provider isn't paying a visit. For James Redwine, everyday tasks like taking a shower aren't possible without help. Getting in and out of the shower is the most dangerous part of my day. I've already fallen and broken a hip in the shower. He lives with spastic cerebral palsy but is doing well these days thanks to surgery and assistance from Indrum Home Care and Hospice. This time last year I weighed uh, 50 pounds more and I was completely confined in a wheelchair. Patients like Redwine spend more time at home because of this list of services. In-house physical therapy, occupational therapy, speech therapy, and skilled nursing services. And a nurse aide to come in and do the baby. Care includes that of patients with coronary artery disease and congestive heart failure, and technology is improving the way they're monitored. We offer a CardioCom, which is placed in the patient's home that can monitor blood pressure, blood sugar, and it sends those readings to our nurses who are monitoring that 24 hours a day. Redwine happily volunteered to help demonstrate the technology. Okay, James, we're going to take your blood pressure. I mean, it gives exact instructions so the patient can, can perform it on their own self. Please remain still and do not talk. We also can put a scale with the CardioCom in there and we weigh them every day, we take their blood pressure every day, and if those readings are out of the parameters of what the doctor has set it for, then they'll get a call from the nurse, and then we can immediately call the doctor. Your blood pressure is... This type of care can mean fewer hospital visits, and in Redwine's case, just one more good reason to move to Lubbock. I love being here, and Interim was a big part of the reason that I wanted to go ahead and move. For more information about interim home care and hospice, visit the health section of myfoxlubbock.com. For Fox 34, your health, I'm Nicole Garza.